Hey guys, good morning, good evening, gamers, where the hell are you right now? It doesn't even matter. But today we're going to play again a game just called Serve in the Ultimate Feed. So right now we're again Mount Torment, if I remember correctly. So we got Butterscotch over here and... Uh... Sure, yeah, I forgot. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, but right now it's currently Valentine's Day, so... Hey Valentine, happy Valentine's Day for each of you everyone. If you're watching right now, actually it's kind of been scheduled right now, but currently it's Valentine's Day, so very nice actually. Be showing me right now, very nice! And happy Valentine's Day everyone, so yeah, we're going to continue right now. So yeah, I remember we were at Mount uh, uh, what's her name? Gumdrop just froze because she wants to find the frozen cremelia i forgot about it but the, but it's like the sky blue one so they need to find that but in order for that one they need to find the order of which but we actually did actually anyways so yeah so i guess we're going to continue anyways so without further ado we're going to continue now guys okay after receiving directions from treat okay so treat is like the one that got gumdrop the whoop the period continues up the mountain your syrup felt at ease knowing gumdrop was safe but Butterscotch seemed to be having a rough time. Things only got worse and they, as they run into trouble. Hey! Uh, scary wolf! Kawaii! A, a real wolf? What are you doing? Scare it off with your magic! Oh, that's cute, dude! Ha! Ah, take this monster! Whoop! Oh! <laughs> you, you turn it pink? That was supposed to be a fireball! I don't know what happened! Oh, either way, I guess it work. Lucky break. Uh, butterscotch. You wouldn't happen to have like a curse on you or anything, right? Rude. I'm not cursed. I'm. I, Rude. I'm not cursed. I'm completely fine. I just lost focus and messed up. It happens to everyone. Your teeth are chattering. What happened to your magic protection against the cold? It got expired. <laughs> It's it's oh, uh, it's it's windy. I mean, I'm not as strong as I thought. Are you happy? Over here, your coat. She can feel. Over here, your coat. Ah, uh, do you want my coat? What? No, you don't. You need it, don't you? Uh, I can make a sacrifice if it means you'll talk normally again. Oh, I guess we had the fucking lab coat again. Uh, thanks? You're not as mean as I thought. Oh. <clears throat> we had the pink one and the normal one. Uh, it came back with more? Uh, time to go. Oh. <sighs> okay, so. Syrup and butterscotch escape into a frozen cave. The witch hastily seals the entrance with, it, with ice, forcing the wolves to abandon their chase. Exhausted, the bird takes a well-deserved rest. Who are you doing something in the ice cavern? Uh, hey, you alright? Uh, no, this is awful. I should have stayed home. Home with Toki, but it's safe and warm. Well, at least we should be able to find what we're looking for in here. This is the exact environment Frosted Cremilia tribes in. Uh, you can just chill here if you want. I'm going further in. Uh, how do you make a joke in a time like this? You're as bad as Toby. Uh, Syrup, wait, don't leave me alone. <laughs> That's cute though. I was worried the fucking ice cavern would be very nice, dude. That's good. Uh, whoop, yep, found it. Jerk, how could you leave me behind like that? Oh, is that what we came for? Uh, yeah, I just need to grab some of the fruit and we can go home. Uh, get and grab a ton so we never have to come back. Take only what you need. Just take only what you need, I guess. It's nice. We just take all you can carry because we might... Take all only what you need. Uh, I don't have use for this many and if I need more, we've got experience now. It won't be nearly as much trouble for us the second time, right? You want to... You want to go through all this again? I don't know, I think we made an alright team. But all I did was mess up. Oh my god, we came for it, didn't we? No, let's get out of here. Um, hey! You look really cold. Just take your jacket back. Uh-huh, yeah. Don't worry about me. You're smaller. 
You need all the warmth you can get. I don't know if I'd hug me it. It's your jacket, so just stick it back already. Well, if you insist. Hey. Alright, magic the ice away so we can get out of here. Right? Take this! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that is happening. Quit messing around and break the ice. Uh, what if the wolf is still there? I don't hear them or see their shadows. We should be fine. Right? Okay, we're good. Okay. Right. Okay, we're real this time. Yeah. Uh, is something wrong? I'm just stressed out. I mean, my cheeks are breaking right. Shut up. So, we're trapped in here. No, we're not trapped. I'm a great witch. You can spell doesn't want to happen. Uh... Okay, we're a little trapped. <laughs> Magic is connected to your state of mind, right? Uh, try to calm down. Oh, I'm calm as frick. Oh, water is caught. Everything is under control. My emotions are completely on. Uh, that's not. <laughs> I'm completely in check, so my magic should be working just fine. Oh, uh, butterscotch? Butterscotch. Honey. Talk to me. What's wrong? I don't know. It's cold. What if I can get us out of here? Are we gonna die because of me? Uh, no, you're a great witch, remember? Uh, we'll make it. But I can't even get this world. But I can't even get the spell to work. Still, in the cave was an accident in the first place. I panic and it just. Uh, hey, hey, you got it. You've got talent. If you can make gum drop, you can melt ice. So you just take a deep breath and try again. I didn't. Uh, I didn't make gum drop. I don't know who did. Ooh. I just took the credit to make myself look better. I'm so sorry you thought wrong. Eh? Stupid! I stupid wall! Stupid! Stupid! Oh! Grah! <laughs> and it just breaks. Oh. That's cute enemies. Oh, Butterscotch, is your magic still going haywire because you look different? What? I-, I oh. My spell team went down? So look at me. Spot is just an illusion, it's not for real me. Uh, that's not very convincing. <laughs> this is what you meant. That wolf girl, that wolf girl from the port told me you were wasting all your magic with some useless spell. It's not useless, I need it. I can't let anyone expect except Toby see me this way. Please don't tell anyone. Uh, why do you hide behind a transformation all the time? People don't take you seriously when you look like I do. I want to be a beautiful. You're some witch that everyone admires. But instead, I'm... I'm... You're? Everything about me is fake, right? I'm always lying to everyone. I'm barely any good with magic and I can't even bear to let anyone see what they really look like. And now we're gonna die because I'm a big fat coward who can never tell you the truth. Are you happy? Well, say something. Aren't you gonna yell at me? Don't you hate me? I hate you? I don't hate you. Uh, I don't hate you at all, Butterscotch. I never have. Well, what are you saying? Sometimes I wonder where we always fighting. Okay, let's okay, let's be good okay again this time, okay? So let's not a bitch. In this game, I just want everyone to be good, dude. Like, all of us. You know, this game's comfy and why you destroy it anyways, dude. Okay. Uh, sometimes I wonder why we're always fighting. And I guess it's because that's the way we are. But it's not like I ever actually hated you. You're lying. Why would I lie? There's no point since we'll both be dead soon and up and up. Unless you figure a way out of here, that is. But I mean, I thought you hated anyone who can do magic. You do, don't you? Uh, that's not it. I just... I think that being able to do things without magic takes an incredible understanding of the world and its elements. And that's awesome. 
So when it feels like no one else sees that, I get frustrated. Maybe I don't trust magic users in general, but still, no, I've never hated you just for being a witch. What? Why are you staring at me like that? Aren't you at least gonna make fun of me for looking like this? Uh, why should anyone care what you look like? It's not their business. You're not hurting anyone, so who cares? You just don't get it. Everyone thinks you're cool and you don't even have to try. You don't know what it's like. Hey, I try hard to be taken seriously too. Everyone sees my alchemy as a gimmick. It's like I'm doing cheap tricks compared to anyone else in that town full of magic users. Well, anyone can make decent candy with magic, but yours tastes the best. Uh, of course they do. I'm a genius when it comes to candy making. Jeez, you're so confident. Uh, I have to be. Otherwise, I'd just give up and do something boring with my life instead. Oh, <laughs> why are you hating me? Why, why are you- why are you- why are you- why are you hating me now, Steve? What the hell? Why are you putting- I don't know. I can't speak. Hey, remember the day we first met? When it came to your store to make fun of how bad your alchemy would make candy taste, but then you forced me to try a piece? And you were so impressed that you begged me to teach you how to make them. But I was still mad so I refused and you declared as rivals. Yeah, I remember. Ah, I just think, maybe if not for our big egos, we could have become friends sooner. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe. Ah, uh, thanks, Syrup. I feel a lot better. My magic might work now, so I'm gonna give it another shot. Oh. With her mind at ease, Butterscotch is finally able to focus and melt away the wolf of ice and the trap appear in the cavern. They make them make they make their way back down the mountain without incident. Oh nice, 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 nice. So when I'm frozen and very relieved, Gondra, eager to get working on the ultimate feat, they promptly return Butterscotch to her cottage. Hey. Okay. Uh Toby, I'm home! Toby, I'm home! Our mission was a success. Um What about Gumdra? What the hell? Uh Master Oh, your spell? I know, don't worry. It's a long story. I'll tell you later. Oh. You have, you have, dog sent on you. Those wolves didn't give you any trouble, did they? Yeah, did they? Yeah, I should have went with you. I was just being a scaredy cat. Oh, that's you, Toby. Oh, hey, I went just fine. Calm your whiskers. You were worried about me? Oh, why would I be? You went on a dangerous mission with your greatest rival. All that could have done gone wrong, yeah. Oh, guess we probably shouldn't say anything about almost freezing to death then. Oh, what? Oh, what? Uh, she, she, uh, she's joking, she's joking. Anyway, anyway, I shouldn't keep Gumdrop waiting outside. Uh, see ya. Oh, hey, hey, before you go. There's one more thing I should tell you about. Promise you won't hate me? Oh. Uh, yeah, I promise. Okay, I... I've been using this crystal ball to spy on your lab sometimes. I'm really sorry. Uh, oh, what? Here, take it. it won't, I won't use it anymore. I know it was bad, but I wanted to try to learn how you make candy so I can do it myself. But your science is just too confusing and I couldn't figure it out at all, so it was all for nothing. I'm really, really sorry. Oh, um, <laughs> I just keep changing the voice. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh, thanks for telling me, I guess. You, you don't hate me? I said I wouldn't. <sighs> I wasn't sure how you take it. I thought you'd be a lot better. Well, we did just get back from our near-death experience. The fact you've been spying on me seems kinda inconsequential after that. Yeah, but there's this one night recorded on there. I think you'll probably want to see it. And what night is that? Ooh, what happened? What happened? 
just watch it later when you get a chance. It's important. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, syrup. Are you ready to return home and finish the ultimate feed? Ah. Uh, yeah. Sorry to keep you waiting uh, later, Butterscotch. I uh, don't the, don't forget to bring me some when it's done. I won't forgive you if I don't get to taste it. Oh. Uh, hey, we're back. It's late. I was starting to get really worried. Uh, I'm sorry to have worried you, Master Pastel. But we are working on a top secret surprise. And we will tell you all about our adventure when it is finished. Uh, a surprise? Uh, okay then. I'll hold up on and asking where you've been all day. Uh, we'll be downstairs, so don't come in until we finish working, alright? So the surprise is a special treat. I should have guessed. Just trying to stay up all night. I know how you get when you're working on something big. Uh, I don't need you giving me a bedtime. I'll sleep when it's done. Syrup's enthusiasm for desserts is unmatched. Let us begin our work. Uh, come on, this is Okay, syrup and gumdrop retreat to the basement, spending hour after hour preparing the ultimate sweet. Finally, all that's left is to let it chill overnight. Um, uh, we're that good, Gumdrop. Thanks for all your help. I'm glad I could be of assi- <laughs> I'm glad I could be of assistance. I cannot wait for Master Pastel to try it. Uh, yeah, me too. You stay here and keep an eye on this thing. I'm gonna go pass out. Oh, Roger that. I will see you in the morning. Okay, this is- Oh, so this one's different now. <clears throat> okay, now is a good chance to watch whatever's on this on this thing. Okay, so now we might look into the crystal ball. Let's see what Butterscotch wanted to show me. Eh? So now I know. Okay, so once I remember that Butterscotch gave the freaking like ball into syrup. I was thinking that since Pastel doesn't have like enough chance to like have screen time, I was just, I was just thinking. And yet, Butterscotch didn't make uh, Gumdrop. I know that it must be Pastel since it was the only one that got into it. Yeah, so maybe it was Pastel. And yeah, it was actually Pastel. So yeah, I guess my theory is correct on that one. I <laughs> guess okay, that should be it. Did it work? Are you alive now? Maybe I messed up the spell. So both... So both... I still know witchcraft and science and alchemy. So maybe that's it. Uh, hello master. What is your command? Oh, you're working. I did it. Please issue a command. Ah, uh, right, right, right. Ah. Uh, I didn't think this true. What's the best way to explain? Okay, I have this friend. She's not very so- Oh, that's cute. She's not very sociable and has kind of a thing against magic. It's really hard for her to make friends here. Please issue a command. <laughs> oh yes, I'm sorry. I guess what I'm asking is, maybe you could try? Even though you're made from magic, you also can be. So it should be okay, I think. Unable to process. Please state your command clearly. Ah, uh, I really should have thought this dope crew better. Uh, please try to get along with my friends group. Unable to process. Please provide instructions on how to get along. Well, first of, well, first of all, the way you talk is really unnatural. Try speaking more casually. You know, be friendly. How is this? <laughs> how is this? Better, better. Keep talking. Um, I still don't understand what you want me to do, Master. It sounds too complicated. Oh, I'm sorry. I know golems aren't usually used for things like this. <laughs> but I didn't have much of a choice. My friend hates talking to magic users. Uh, speaking of which, she absolutely cannot know that I made you. She still thinks I'm just like her and can't use magic. Okay, I will work hard. Uh, right now, I think you're... Right now, we think you're doing great. Just keep acting like a regular person and you'll be friends with her in no time. Acting like? Yeah. Even though you're made out of candy, 
It feels like I'm talking to a real human. Just keep being yourself. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> me myself? Yep. Consider that to be your main objective. Hopefully, it's simple enough. Not uh, human, but I am Candy. Huh? Be myself. Act like a person. I am Candy. But act? Uh, oops. Maybe it was too complicated. Be Candy. Act like myself. Ah, <laughs> uh, stop. Uh, it just reset. Uh, did I break you? <laughs> Looks like I messed it up again. This one seems so promising. Probably have a better luck getting side to talk to other magic users than getting a golden to recreate. There's a lot of candy to go to waste though. I guess I'll take it apart the then. Come drop? But this one actually talked to me. Uh, she was sentient. Hey, if I give up now, would it be like I killed you? Uh, I won't give up on you. I won't give, you I won't give up on syrup either. We're going to be friends somehow, I swear it. Oh, now she knows. Syrup is still awake. It was very really lonely down there, so I... What is it you are holding? Uh... Pastel made you? Huh? No, you absolutely cannot know that. Uh, why not? Master Pastel said you hate talking to magic users, so you absolutely cannot know. Forget, forget! Okay, okay, forgot. You really forgot? Uh, yeah. You were made by that rotten witch as an elaborate prank, right? Yes, and that Master Pastel. We had nothing to do with it. I know it was that witch, not Pastel. That good for nothing wouldn't know the first thing about making a magic golem. Master Puzzle is not that good for nothing, but other than that, you are exactly right. <laughs> oh man. Syrup is slapping? Why? Uh, it's just funny. You made you exactly my type. Well, aside from your radio personality. You did not make me. You said you forgot. Alright, I forgot. For real this time, but now I'm going to have to think about a scotch instead. You are grateful? Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was okay with just having Basil around, but breaking a new print was kind of fun. Dude! Print? Do you mean that at last we're getting along? I think we have been for a while now. And my task has been complete, and you're only telling me just now? I didn't know it was your task a little bit ago. Uh, sorry. Oh, Master Basil will be so happy to hear of this. We must inform him right away. Oh, wait, wait. I have a few questions for you about what you are. You're only following past. Past your creation's orders. And acting friendly towards me, right? Does it that mean it's all kind of pig? After you tell him... We've been getting along, and he says that's enough, then it's whatever, this is, then it's whatever. Is this just over? Would you like to hear the honest answers to him? I don't know. At first, I thought you were a very pushy and selfish person. I worked very hard, I, at first I thought you were a very pushy and selfish person. I keep switching persons, I forgot, I forgot switching persons, I'm sorry. I work very hard to be as friendly as I could. <clears throat> But I think that also makes me pushy and selfish, like you. But there are many times you have been kind to me when I did not serve you to do so. You also work hard for Master Pastel to make the ultimate sweet. I was instructed to act as a human. Although I am candy, maybe that means I am not capable of sincere feelings. But you have always treated me well despite that. I would like to prove to you that I can also defy expectations. Oh, uh, come girl. Now I'm going to go with my Master Pastel's bedside so that I may tell him the moment he wakes up that we have a chip getting along. Uh, no, don't do that. It's creepy. Understood. So if it's seeming creepy, I will stand here in the dark until he comes downstairs. Uh, the way you put that sounds creepy too. I guess you can help it though, huh? This is creepy. That is creepy. I just can't wait with you, Syrup. 
I should go to sleep and not worry about how I pass the time. Ah, uh, alright, alright. See you in the morning. Okay, so I'm gonna go end this one no game room, so maybe that was a good part for an ending. But we know that uh, Pastel created syrup, so which is very nice, but at least everyone just go and got an epic ending. I don't know if we actually got the ending. I don't know, but I'm gonna go end this one again, So like, subscribe, all of those shits. All of those shits. I like this one now, actually. I'm so sorry if my voice wasn't that great. Uh, like, like, subscribe, all of those shits. Comment to be in the comment notification bell. And thank you guys for watching. And see you guys next time. Bye bye. Jani, 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 matane. Bye bye. I like this game very much.